You're watching DVE TV. Television without the picture. Tonight on DVE TV, from the makers of CSI, Crime Scene Investigators, and CSI Miami comes CSI Pittsburgh. The Crime Scene Investigating team from Las Vegas does a tour of duty in the Steel City. What do we got here? As a 30-something male, presumed dead for about an hour. What happened? Well, he apparently stumbled out of Nick's Fat City after seeing a rock act and collapsed in a pile of his own puke. Who was it? Donnie Iris. Any witnesses? Yeah, those two guys over there. Have you questioned them? Well, I tried to. What do you mean you tried to? Go ahead. You'll see. You just got to get to know the locals here in Pittsburgh, Sully. It just requires a little understanding. Hey, fellas. I'm Detective Peterson, CSI. CSI? Really? That's a good school. I heard you has got a good football team. Football team? What CSI stand for anyhow? Dunce, Carnegie Science Institute. Oh yeah, it's the right, only better. CSI, fellas, stands for Crime Scene Investigation. The only crime was when you guys lost to Allegheny in overtime last year. Yeah, you guys got robbed on that one. No, no, we're not a school. We're the crime scene investigators. Hey. Oh, you guys open for Donnie Irish tonight. Hey, you are all right, eh? Little lad, though. He's right, you are a little lad. I don't think you understand. I'm a police officer from the CSI Pittsburgh, the crime scene investigator. I told him not to pee in the alley, officer. Hey, hey, arrest me, all right? Huh? It's in the Bill of Rights. If you got to go bad enough, you can drain the weasel because it's unconstitutional to make someone pee in their leaves. <laughs> All right? You just can look it up. Plus, if you arrest him, you're going to arrest everyone else down here because everyone's peeing in an alley on the side side. I'm not here about you peeing in the alley. I'm here about the man that died on the side of Carson Street here. Judging from the blood at the scene, I'd say he'd been here about an hour. That ain't blood. No, yeah, that's just red devil sauce dripping from some permanies. <laughs> I'd, I'd say capicola and egg. Uh, less than an hour old, though, Kojak. Still spicy. All right, then. No more BS. Uh, you ain't you ain't got to be getting heavy or nothing, you know? Did either of you see what happened? Yeah. yeah. Well, what happened to him? Well, well, oh, from my guy, perspective, I thought it maybe was like hey, a to situation. one at a time. Yeah. Which one? The one that peed in the alley. Technically, we both peed in the alley. All right, then. The one with the Steelers jersey go first. We both got Steelers jerseys on. Well, his looks more like a sweater. Yeah, but I got a Steelers jersey on underneath the sweater. All right, all right. The one in the Eric Pegram jersey go first. What happened to this man? How did he end up face down dead and nearly decapitated by every cab on Carson? Ain't no cabs on Carson. What happened? All right, all right, all right. So I saw him stagger out of the front door, Nick's, okay, like this. And he ends up face down like he got stabbed or something. So he got stabbed? I don't think so. But you want my honest opinion? Yes! I think Donnie Iris just rocked the dude unconscious. <laughs> I'm serious. I've seen it happen before at the Fayette County Fair in 1992. This guy did a timber right there. Boom! Right? He might have had more than a concussion if he if he hadn't like landed on his elephant ear. You're saying that you think the man was literally rocked to death by Donnie Iris? You see him uh, up close like that in a small venue? It don't sound lame brain if you have. So what do you think? Do you think he was rocked to death by Donnie Iris? No, I think he ate some of that cat on a stick over here and his lower intestines ruptured. Why don't you like that stuff? It ain't that yeah, bad. Yeah, it ain't that bad for a cat on a stick. That's it. I'm making the call. Thanks for your help, fellas. Who you calling a coroner? No, my agent. I'm going to see if I can get out of this contract and back on the touring production of Art. He's, he's at about Art Senior. I heard that's a good one. <laughs> CSI Pittsburgh. Watch it tonight, because they probably won't come back to do another episode.